I'm going to show you how to accept a referral and enroll the client in a program. We can start by looking at the client. And in the history tab, we can see the referral is pending to the housing program. To accept the referral, I want to go to the referrals tab. And on the pending page, I can see the client. I can edit the referral. And then when I look at it, I can see it's referred to the housing program. And there's a unit that's reserved for the client. I can go down to the status and change from pending to pending in process. And click save changes. Changing the referral to pending in process accepts the client to my program, but I still need to go and enroll the client in order to complete the process. When I go back to the pending tab, I can see that the referral is now green where it was white before, and this shows that it's now pending in process. I go back to the client now and to the programs tab. And here's the list of programs that are available. And this uh, referral is assigned to the housing program. So I'm going to enroll her here. When I go down, I can see that there's a pending referral and I can see that program placement is a result of a referral. I want to make sure this is selected so that the referral will be linked to the enrollment. And I also want to make sure to include the group members so that the group will be enrolled together as a family. And I can click enroll and fill out the enrollment page for each family member. And I'm just making this up, it's an example. I'm just gonna say no to everything. And because it's a permanent housing program, I received this warning telling me that the client will be removed from the community queue, which is what I want anyway. So I'm going to click OK. And now fill out the enrollment for the children. And now I can see that the group is enrolled. The head of household is the original client and here are the group members. And if I go to the history tab, I can see that the referral is now completed and that it's linked to the enrollment.